Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with some more Mosaic UEFA Euro Soccer. Two box, random country break number 10. We sold 12 spots here, and one spot gets you two countries, and of course all cards ship. Very big thanks to everybody here for getting in on it. And let's double those names up. Like Sir Mix-a-Lot, all the countries are in. Let's roll it. Let's randomize names and countries five and a two, seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. After seven times, we got Leo down to Scott. Five and a two, seven times for the countries. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. After seven, we've got Germany down to Scotland. All right, Leo with Germany, Taylor with Denmark. I think they're playing tomorrow. Belgium fell to the Italians today. They, I feel like they had a lot of chances. Ryan with Sweden, Taylor with Austria, Matthew with the Netherlands. Ryan with France, Leo with Portugal and Finland, Cody with Italy, the Italians are looking good, and the Ukraine, Craig with Russia, Scott with North Macedonia, Daniel with Slovakia, Matthew with England, they're playing tomorrow as well, Jesse with Croatia, Leo with Wales, Ryan with Turkey, Jesse with Spain, Spain moving on in penalties, Daniel, Czech Republic, Scott with Hungary, Craig with Switzerland, they were down to 10 men, got it all the way to PKs, didn't quite get there, Ryan with uh, Poland, Spain beat Switzerland. Ryan with Poland and Scott with Scott with Scotland. All right, so let's sort by, let's alphabetize by country right here. I brought two uh, random boxes of that mosaic soccer from the back, and we've got two more breaks of this from that case, and that might be it after that. I'll take I'll take a look. I'll I'll look. Look through the big hit garden and see if we can uh, find some more mosaic. But for now, that might be it. All right, we're, we're going to pause the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades, and then we'll have the break. Stick around. All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. No deals were done here in this break on Friday the 2nd. Thanks, everyone, for making this happen. Appreciate it. We got the sounds of a Copa America match on in the background. We got Peru and Paraguay battling in penalties. And each team has three made after their first five shots, but no one wants to seem to win this one here. I haven't seen PKs go past the initial five shots in a minute or two. Some tired legs out there. There it is. Peru makes it. Gets the fourth goal. They went on penalties 4-3. We've got a Brazil match coming up after this. Two boxes of some pretty good stuff here. All right, good luck, everybody. All card ship. And for rookies like that, probably worth looking up some of these guys or just hanging on to them because who knows if they could be, they could end up being bigger names in the future. 
Guys like Jack Grealish are kind of bigger names now. And our autograph is Timothy Fosu Mensa for the Orange. Rookie autograph going to Matthew and the Netherlands. Last spot mojo strikes again. And got rookie mosaic right here for Croatia. I like that in recent years, Panini started started putting the the rookie card designation on these cards. Now, I would imagine, since this is a Euro tournament set, that their first year in the Euro, is that what they're, in, the, in a major tournament, is that what they're suggesting? There's a Louis, or Louis, Schaub for Austria. That'll be for Taylor. The Cristiano Ronaldo goes to Leo and Portugal. Phil Foden, of course, a lot of a lot of up and coming English players here. Matthew with England. Nice Christian Eriksen. Here's Diogo Jota for Portugal. Leo. Fun to watch him play. I'm a Liverpool supporter, and he's a fun player to watch. Jaden Sancho. He just made a made his move to Man United from uh, from the Bundesliga to Man United. That might give him a little boost in uh, in secondary market value. There's a rookie mosaic for uh, Poland that goes to Ryan Lynn. Mason Mount. It's gonna be a, the late game. In fact, we'll be probably watching the second half of that game together on Saturday tomorrow. Ukraine, England. Here's a rookie mosaic pattern for Hungary. This is Dominic for Scott and Hungary. Tyler Roberts for Wales. It's going to go to Leo. Sky Havertz for Germany. That's going to go to Leo as well. Steve saying it's coming home for the three lines. bit of a rough tournament for Mbappe for France, Ryan Lynn, but he's super young. He'll be back. Yeah, England has been looking pretty great, especially uh, defensively. Have How many goals have they given up this entire tournament? There's Scott McKenna for Scotland, which belongs to Scott. Scott with the Scott. It's Mason Greenwood as well. Here's a Silver Immobile. They've been having a good tournament for for Italy. Have they conceded zero goals, England? I thought, that, I thought there was like one. I know it's it's a very low number. So that defense has been really strong. That has definitely helped them. And they've got enough uh, they've got enough offense to just kind of to surprise you. Because you'll blink and all of a sudden it's like, oh, <laughs> we just conceded a couple of goals. He has, yeah. Jack Grealish has putting, been putting in some, some good service to some players here. And Harry Kane hasn't really even, I mean, he's, he's still a threat when he's on the pitch, but 
I mean, if he starts like scoring goals the way we know he can, plus that uh, plus that defense, that's gonna be pretty. Uh, that's gonna be pretty hard to stop. Be very difficult to stop that team. Second box, another two boxes in the store, folks. I'm sure we can run back uh, another break of this tonight. Uh, there's Attila uh, Zalai for Hungary, for Scott. We've got uh, Trincao, 51 out of 99 for Portugal. It's going to be for Leo. There's a silver killing Mbappe. Might be a it might be a decent buy low time for killing Mbappe if people are making a knee-jerk reaction from, from that penalty miss. But if people are uh, are giving up on him too early, it might be a good one to go for. Him. There's Pedro Neto. Nice autograph for Portugal. That's gonna be for Leo. There's Bukayo Saka for England. And a silver rookie, Ezgian Alioski for North Macedonia, Scott Blackwell. Yeah, Phil Foden, I feel like, I want to say the very first match, I feel like Phil Foden had a really good chance at a, at a goal, but didn't convert and has seemed a little anonymous since. There's Pau Torres. But yeah, yeah maybe San Jaden Sancho. Grealish should be starting matches. I mean, I, I would I would probably say yes, but yeah, I, I agree with PJ right there. I was gonna say the same thing. If you're winning, you really don't have to change much. Why 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 mix it up if the formula is working? You know, maybe maybe everyone kind of knows their roles and can mentally prepare for it. You know, if you're, if Adam, you know, if uh, Jack Grealish knows, hey, I know I'm going to come off the bench, you know, and I could mentally prepare for whatever that game plan is going to be off the bench, maybe that, maybe that's been the plan all along. There's Jao Felish for Portugal, Leo. All right, and the last little bit here in random country break number 10. And we we'll close out with this uh, montage card for Jan Vertanian. And that's that. Thanks for watching, everybody. That was two box random country break number 10. 
of uh, Mosaic UEFA Euro Soccer. A lot of fun stuff, a lot of great footy here. Another two boxes in the store on jazbeescasebreaks.com. Check it out, and I'll break that with you next time. Bye-bye.